welcome back to another one of my videos um, I'm sorry I sound sick right now I've been sick for the past week and a half or two weeks I don't even know I lost count um, but yeah uh, welcome back uh, if you guys don't know me hi I'm Tanya welcome to honey stories um quick update quick update on my hair um this is what it's looking like i ended up bleaching and dyeing or er, bleaching and toning it one more time after the video um and this is what it looks like there is some purple tones in there because of the um purple shampoo that i've been using but um i like it um, it doesn't look you know bad or anything <clears throat> actually it looks pretty cool the purple tones in there um but yeah so if you guys haven't read the title already basically um what i'm gonna be doing is a uh, makeup tutorial i guess or whatever um <laughs> i have been getting a lot of requests on on how i do my eyebrows or whatnot um i did do like a couple get ready with me videos already where you guys see where you guys see kind of like how i do them but um, I'm going to try to like zoom in so you guys can like see what I'm doing. And I'm just going to do, I'm going to do one eyebrow with you guys. Um, and then I also um, got a request to do a specific makeup look or eyeshadow look. Which I'll be um, inserting a picture here. So um, I'm going to do that makeup look and I'm also going to show you guys how I do my eyebrows. Um, as you guys can see, I barely have eyebrows. Uh, fun fact, I've never, ever, ever went to a salon or had anyone pluck my eyebrows, wax my eyebrows, none of that. Never in my life. I've always just like um, did my eyebrows by myself, just like with the tweezers. Um, when I, w I started doing my eyebrows, like filling them in when I was like really young um so it took time to get them how they look uh now you know how i do them now um and yeah i mean i've gone through so many eyebrow phases it's not even funny like i've had like really thin eyebrows i've had really thick eyebrows i've had eyebrows that are almost connected like i've been through it all and another uh, fun fact, I just started uh, learning how to do like my winged eyeliner. Um, and then hopefully next I learn how to put fucking eyelashes on because I have a few pairs of eyelashes and I don't even know how to put them on. So it's like, why do I have them? You feel me? So for those of you guys that watched my previous uh, Get Ready With Me videos, um, I don't need a lot. I don't um contour i don't um put foundation all i do is conceal um my eye i do the concealer i do my eyebrows i do eyeshadow um eyeliner and mascara a little bit of highlight like on my nose and stuff um and then like the inner corners of my eyes but that is it um so if you guys clicked on this thinking that i'm gonna do my full face um yeah i'm not so don't waste your time <laughs> don't waste your time in watching this video all right i'm just gonna plug like the excess hairs that i have under my eyebrow and in the middle right now so that's just what i'm gonna do really quick before i get started with um with the whole tutorial whatever oh and i have my mirror here just so you guys know so i'm gonna be looking this way and then when i get to doing like my eyebrows and my eyeshadow i'm gonna zoom in so you guys could kind of see what i'm doing because i am kind of far so i'm just gonna like zoom the camera in so you guys can see exactly what i'm doing Let's get started. Um, the first 
the first thing that I do um, when I do my makeup is oh another thing um don't mind my nephew he's in the other room playing so if you hear a little boy making noise it's my nephew in the other freaking room so <laughs> so yeah but the first thing that i do when i do my makeup is my eyebrows my that's like a must so um I'm not gonna go ahead and explain every single product that I use because in my previous videos I did that um, but really quick just because my main focus in this video is my eyebrows and my eyeshadow um, I'm just gonna go over again what I use um, and I just use this one it's kind of faded so It's kind of faded, but it's the Maybelline Tattoo Studio. I have it in a um, deep brown, I believe. Um, I need to get a lighter shade just because my hair is lighter. Um, and look, my roots are already coming out. That's how long it's been, but I'm so sorry. I've been sick. Um, so yeah, so that's just what I use. And then um, they usually come with like a little brush like this. It has like the angled brush and then it has a brush. So then what I start off by doing is just like going in like this kind of motion really lightly. Just focusing. Okay, so I guess I have to be back here. And I just keep going with the same emotion. Um, then I just like comb it. Uh, I do take a long time to do my eyebrows, so. And then I just start forming them as I go, but very, very, very lightly. Just because my hair is light, you want to go ahead and do it, you know, darker or whatever. And that's your preference. This is just how I do my eyebrows. Okay, so we have something going on there. And then when I get to like this part right here, I do it even lighter. And then I just stop and I kind of like Home it out. Y'all see that how it's turning out? And my eyebrows done. Um, yeah. <laughs> I can't zoom in more because then it, it blurs up, but that's basically the eyebrow. Um, in a little bit, I'm going to just go in with some concealer and just, um, just make uh, the line right here pop, I guess 
just to make it look cleaner. Um, but yeah, but I'll show you guys that in a little bit. Um, and yeah, so I'm just gonna put this right under my eyes. Three little dots. Just take like an angled brush, like this one. It has like concealer on it, sorry. But um, but yeah, and then I just go in and I just perfect the line. And then I see that. I mean, I don't know if it's just like me but I mean I see a difference already and then I just do it that much and then I go in with my little sponge and I just like dab it like so And there you have it, my eyebrow. Okay, so I zoomed out. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the left eyebrow and I will be back. <laughs> so I'm all done with my eyebrows. Um, the next thing that I do is put my eyeliner on my waterline. Um, quick tip. Um, for girls that don't have long eyelashes, um, it usually helps when you put eyeliner on your waterline on the top. Um, it just gives us, it just gives it the illusion that you have long eyelashes. So um, I know what I'm talking about because my eyelashes be popping. So um, <laughs> so yeah, just a quick tip. But um, that's what I'm gonna do right now. Um, I'm not gonna go ahead and explain what I'm using or whatnot. Um, it's the same thing from the other video. Um, once I switch up, um, like eyeliners and stuff, then that's when I'll show you guys and stuff. But it's the same, same crap. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the eyeliner, and I just like hold my lid and I like do it, <laughs> cause then I want to blink. <laughs> Okay, so you see, it does something. Y'all see that, right? Now for the next step is my eyeshadow. So for that, I'm gonna zoom it hella, and um, I don't know if I'm just gonna voice over it or I'm gonna talk. I'm probably gonna talk and then end up voicing over it. Um, just because my nephew, like I said, my nephew's playing in the next room and I don't want you guys to hear him um yelling and stuff so so yeah <laughs> i might uh voice over it but what i used um in the beginning was hold on i actually got this new palette um i'm not gonna lie i got it from the dollar store well yeah i got it from five below um it's very good quality actually for it being a five below makeup palette I'm not gonna lie like they have so many like palettes in there but I mean this one just stood out to me just because like of the colors and it just looked like um it just looked good quality compared to like the other ones that were there um, but it's just this one right here this one and um, you see it just comes with like all of these different shades and um so yeah so from what i remember um i used the color flashback right here i'm going to use this one just um like in the crease and kind of like um expand it like on the on the like the brow bone 
or like by like close to the eyebrow but not like all the way to the eyebrow look yeah y'all gonna see right now I'm like horrible at explaining things so <laughs> I'm gonna do one eye I'm gonna do one eyelid on camera and one off camera so yeah this actually is really fucking dope but then again I'm gonna use the viewfinder and I'm just gonna go right here gonna look kind of weird in the beginning because it's not gonna be blended but um once I blend everything it's gonna look fucking amazing so yeah <laughs> Okay. All right. Now the next thing that I'm going to do is take this little guy right here and I'm going to use this shade right here. Root beer. And I'm just gonna go over this part right here. Y'all see that? So that way you see the first shade, the flashback, and then you see, you know what I'm saying? So I just want, I just want basically the darker color inside and then the lighter one outside, but that you're still able to see it. But I'm going to blend everything out in just a second. I just want to show you guys. And then I'm going to go back in with flashback. You guys see already that it's like blending. Let's just keep doing this circular motion. And it'll look decent. Now for the next shade that I'm going to be using is this shade right here. That purple shade I'm going to use um, and basically what I'm going to do is 
put it in the center right here but not drag it all the way just like leave it in the middle and kind of just blend it with the darker brown So it kind of looks like I have a black eye, but um, <laughs> I promise when I'm done, um, you guys will see the difference and um, yeah. <laughs> And then after I did that, I'm gonna go in with my concealer and just conceal um, the part right here. And um, just to get it lighter and for it to stand out a little bit more. And um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. that's just the eyeshadow um, I'm gonna do my wing eyeliner which I just started um, well, which I just learned actually to do win wing winged eyeliner <laughs> all right now for this I'm going to need my mirror so I'm not gonna be looking this way <laughs> at all. Um, Hopefully you guys can see. I'm sorry if I like get off the like screen, but um, I'm just trying to like see how I'm gonna do this. And yeah, <laughs> I just hold my eye like this. It's gonna look kind of retarded, but this is just my technique on how to do wing eye. that long I think that length is decent actually all right so you guys saw how I did that <laughs> so I'm gonna do the other eye and then I'll do my lashes on camera as well and yeah um, so I'll be back when I do this eye <laughs> okay so I finished the other eye this eye was a pain in the ass right now it was not cooperating my eyeliner was not fucking cooperating but like I said, I just learned how to do my wing eyeliner, so I'm still perfecting it. And, um, and yeah, so this is how it looks. Um, I had to like rub it off and then like redo it. And yeah, so. <sighs> so this is the look so far. I'm gonna go in with my eye, or with my mascara now, and um, 
Oh my god, it's snowing so much right now. Fuck. I should have parked in the garage. But I didn't. So now um, I usually get this one right here. You you can't really see it that well, but um it's this one, it has two in one. It's um Voluminous Superstar Red Carpet Black and it is from L'Oreal. Um, okay, so I'm gonna go in with the white like I usually do in my Get Ready With Me or my makeup tutorials or whatever. I don't know why some girls like they feel some type of way of giving their makeup secrets or like what they use for their makeup but I'm not like that I'm gonna tell you exactly everything that I get where I get it from no matter if it's from a fucking dollar store because your girl being a struggle you feel me I'm not no famous youtuber or none of that shit so <laughs> yeah All right, so I just let it dry for a little bit because I noticed it works better when I let it dry instead of like, so yeah, so like in the morning, if you're like in a rush, then I do not recommend this because you have to let it dry at least for a minute. Um, I mean, a minute's not too long. So, but I mean, for those of you guys that are impatient, um, this is not for you. <laughs> How y'all liking my hair though? with the purple it looks pretty dope right like when I turn it kind of like gives it the illusion that I have purple hair but I really don't so I just pretty much let it dry until like I see the white kind of like not there anymore so now I'm gonna put my mascara on I'm done with my uh, mascara from the top. Um, so it's looking like. See, that eyeliner goes a long way. <laughs> but um, after I do that, um, I just go ahead and with a q tip, I just like clean the bottom part. because I'm gonna go in now with my concealer and put it under my eyes. Ugh. My nose has been so itchy and like just irritated and red since I've been sick. I'm still pretty fucking sick, um, but um, not like before. Before, oh my God, like I was fucking, yeah. <laughs> I was like legit like it takes a lot for me like not to go to work when I'm sick so it was so bad that I had to take a, a sick day um, and I never really it's rare that I uh, take sick days um, but I had to take one because 
like I could not take it anymore like my body was just so drained um, I don't know for those of you guys that follow me on snapchat um, there was a day where I was like oh I don't know why I feel drained woo -woo. Um, well it turns out later on that day that's when I started getting all the symptoms my nose was runny stuffy my throat hurt like it's so crazy how quickly you can get sick <laughs> but but yeah you see how that helped the redness already I'm probably gonna wipe it all, all off in a little bit just because I already know that I'm gonna blow my nose at some point of the day and all of this is gonna come off and my nose is just gonna be red as heck but at least the rest of my makeup is gonna be popping you feel me <laughs> This is actually a shade too light. Um, I let my sister pick out my concealer the other day. Or not the other day, but um, when I got this concealer and I was just like asking her which shade looks better and she's like, that one. So yeah. <laughs> um, next time I'm gonna get a shade darker, but I mean, it still does the job. I just look a little lighter under my eyes, but I mean, it's okay. It's nothing like too bad. And then like once I put like the eyeshadow loud ass car but it's truck <laughs> yeah once I put my um my eyeshadow on the lower part of my lid and then um it doesn't look so white or it doesn't look so bad it still looks light but it doesn't look bad I have like wrinkles under my eyes already. I'm getting so oh. <sighs> okay, so basically what I do under my eyes for this look. Hold on. So for this look, what I do under my eyes is basically the same three colors that I use for the top part. Um I'm gonna use for the bottom part. Um, so the but I'm ugh. but what I'm going to start with actually, or actually no, what I'm going to use is hold on um is um just the darker shade. So um this shade right here and um the purple shade. I'm oh, fuck. I got some on my finger. <laughs> but um so I'm gonna use this shade. To like shade in the outer part and then the purple shade to just shade the rest in and then I'm not gonna go all the way to the corner um, it's basically what I have on top I'm gonna put in the bottom so the three shades in order um, oh, why did I close it I'm gonna need okay <laughs> and I'm only gonna put a little dab and just like smooth it all out because a little dab goes a long way with this dark ass um, eyeshadow so I'm just gonna go ahead and see it's already
and just keep doing this motion until it looks pretty smooth. Like that. And then now for the purple. With the same palette, I'm going to go in with um, the Angelic Shade. With that shade right there, just to, um, for the inner corner of my eye. And then you're gonna go back in with your mascara. So um, that completes that eye look um, when I'm finished. It looks kind of blurry, but um, I don't like how it looks right now. It looks pretty blurry for me. But um, if you guys could see me, great. If not, uh, okay. <laughs> but this is the eye look. I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other side, and then I'll be back. All right, so there you have it. Um, this makeup look that was um, suggested just did uh, maybe yeah basically um what i do for like highlight i guess it's not really highlight i don't buy highlight by itself um i just use this one the same one the angelic one um i just put that one on the inner corners of my eyes and i'm also gonna put some on the tip of my nose Y'all see that? And on this part here. And I'm done. <laughs> But yeah, um, I hope you guys like this video. Um, it is a Saturday right now. Um, it's Saturday night actually. I haven't ate anything so far. It's about to be five in like 20 minutes. I haven't ate anything, um, so I'm gonna go do that. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. And if you guys copy this, uh, who the heck keeps beeping? Okay, but um, if you guys did like it and if you guys do this makeup look, um, send me pictures. I want to see. I want to, you know, post you guys on my Snapchat and all that. So, um, so yeah. So, I hope you guys liked it. I don't know what to call this look, honestly. It's just, like, something I came up with. Um, I've been trying to do my makeup a little bit better and stuff. I don't think I'll ever do, like, a full face because I... 
you really don't need it I don't get acne like that I don't really have like horrible skin um, the only thing I, I really do need is like concealer just because like I barely sleep um, and so like I do wake up with like bags or circles under my eyes so uh, that is a must but um other than that that is it for this video um, I hope you guys liked it once again <laughs> And um, don't forget to like, share, comment, uh, the whole you dig. Um, and don't forget to subscribe, you guys. Um, I'm trying to reach 200 subscribers. So if you guys could do that for me, I would highly appreciate it. And um, yeah, until next time. I might just do another video for you guys right now. Um, since I'm sitting here. But um, yeah, until next time, um, my honeys, I'll see you guys next week. <laughs>